So I'm here with Carlos Noon. We've been talking for like 30 minutes, but no one really knows that. It's great seeing you again, man. How you doing? I'm good, man. I'm good. Now, so we're here at Capital Conquest. Um, why don't you tell me about a little bit what you're doing today? Uh, today, you know, we're just here to help the next generation stay on the path and, uh, you know, grow in skill and technique and have fun, enjoy it, and come together as a community and get, you know, something great done. Right on. Now, how awesome is it to see dozens of forms of martial arts coming together in one room, completely non-political setting? Like, how great is that? As a martial artist, how does that make you feel? Awesome. I, I took part in this uh, event since I was like a little runt, you know, 16, 17, and uh, I'm here again. <laughs> <laughs> do them just kind of like standing the other side of the mat. You know, before I was here, I was a student. Now I'm an instructor, and um, you know, to see everyone just come together and, and put aside their imagined—I call it imagined differences—just as one, we do our thing. You know, and uh, it's pretty neat. That's awesome. That's awesome. So. What were your what were your takeaways? You seen some kids coming out here and picking up jujitsu, like yeah, there's uh, a lot of young, talented ones that stood out, and uh, you know, great to also see some of the guys that I trained with when I was younger here on the mats, learning and training, and uh, it's kind of like a flashback, you know, a blast from the past to see a few of them and just be like, hey, you know, and just wow, you, you know, it's just get on there, roll, exchange ideas, and say, oh, you remember that time you hit me with this? I go, yeah, you know what happened since then? I figured it out, and you know, I realized this doesn't work so well, and then you, know, you share ideas, and you, just, and you too, as an instructor, learn tremendously, because there's such a huge pool of knowledge in there. And you're like, even the kids, you know, seeing that so many kids around you all do something slightly different, you're like, oh, I never saw that, you know, that's interesting. Yeah. That's awesome. That's awesome. Um, do you think, um, like, what, what would your advice be for kids just starting out in jujitsu? I mean, because like you're you're dealing with a lot of students who haven't necessarily trained jujitsu before, and they're like cycling in. Like, do you have any advice for kids who are interested in starting in jujitsu? Uh, well, I was, you know, I I'll share what I share with my kids. You know, don't worry too much about what the name is or anything like that. Focus on how you're doing it, not what you gotta do. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Right on. Uh, my, my last question for you: Like, what have you been up to? Are you training out of anywhere that you want to let anyone know about? I uh, just uh, right now opening a new school. Opening a new school. Uh, you know, little guy started school, so that's a lot of fun. And time to get back in shape. You know, he's 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 now in day school, so I got my day back to myself. So I'm looking forward to you know dropping back down and uh, who knows having some more fun. I hope that's awesome. That's awesome. Well, thank you very much for taking the time. I appreciate it.